Joining me is Dr. Michael Bruce, the sleep doctor. Now we've all heard about a beauty sleep. Sure. Is there really such a thing or is that just kind of a nice thing to say? It is absolutely real and everybody can get it every single night. So here's what we know about sleep and how it affects our appearance. So number one, we know that sleep dramatically affects your ability to lose weight, okay? We know that being able to lose weight is very consistent with sleep deprivation. The more sleep deprived you are, the higher your appetite, the more weight you're going to gain. But there's also some more subtle areas that are important for our appearance as well. If you ever look at somebody who's sleep deprived, you know they're sleep deprived, Yeah, right? there's no hiding it, is there? <laughs> there's no way to hide that. Um, and here's the couple of things that we know. For example, dark circles under the eyes can be a direct effect of sleep deprivation. Now, don't get me wrong. If your mom had dark circles and your grandma had dark circles, there might be a genetic propensity for that. Also, depending upon your culture, you may have different skin pigment there. However, what we know is this is the thinnest skin in the body. And when blood pools underneath the eye due to lowered circulation from sleep deprivation, that's when we start to see dark circles. Same holds true with puffy eyes. So people who have big puffy or bags, what I call under eye baggage, that occurs quite frequently. Again, due to a circulation issue because the more sleep deprived you are, the more your blood pressure can go up. So if that's the case and you say in the thinnest part of the skin, what about the rest of our rosy complexion? How's that affected by sleep? Dramatically. So sleep deprivation lowers circulation. When you have lowered circulation, that means that the nutrients, the minerals, the vitamins, all the things that help us have healthy skin, hair, nails are slower than they should be. So what does that mean? It means paler complexion. It means uh, breakage of the nails, losing hair. S sleep really is beauty sleep. And the, the stage in which it's the most is stage three and four, what we call deep sleep and that's where growth hormone is emitted. So growth hormone is this hormone that goes throughout the body and does all the repair work. So again, if you don't have the repair work, what happens? Your entire complexion is affected and you don't get the beauty sleep that you need. What happens to your hair? You absolutely can have more hair that falls out. Um, your hair can become thinner. Without, without good sleep, you're not getting the nutrients to that whole area of the scalp that's gonna be necessary. And lose the body in your hair. Mm -hmm. and, and so it really is a beauty sleep. It absolutely is a beauty sleep. Now, don't get me wrong, genetics are what genetics are, yeah. right? And people are gonna look a certain way, but why not boost the way that you look or use the materials that you've got to your best advantage? Thank you very much. Once again, valuable information, and thank you for being a guest here on Empowered Health. Thank you. And thank you. We'll see you again.